Two more rubber bands. Can somebody hold? Yeah. 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 Rubber high. Okay. Great. What? There's a little pressure. Pressure because I Now we're gonna pull this down. So we're actually gonna need to take this off. I was gonna try to help you, but <laughs> it's my wingspan. Can't do it. Don't need that. It's an unfortunate problem. Can you pull that up for me? Oh, yeah. Okay. Now it probably works best if we have not, solid we're not quite metal there yet. Around yeah. the other side. Oh, okay. So let's do that. Okay. Now let's try for two more rubber bands, holding that tight. So you have to go around there. <laughs> and now we can't. Well, we can't quit yet. So. Sorry. This video might be good to put on the public lab site. Happy birthday. I tried to do this this summer, um, and I would have appreciated seeing a video. Oh, yeah. yeah. No, I'd, I'd be happy to, oh, so to share it if again. it's useful. Oh, there you go. Absolutely. <laughs> okay. And now, There's a lot more challenging when you're actually doing it. Then, uh, then how it sounds? I know. Yeah. So give it another one. They're just looping rubber bands around the end of the balloon. Okay, and now I think we can clip on. on the carabiner so that we can just clip those strings to the carabiner. Yay! Great like job. that? Does okay. that work? <laughs> <laughs> it's, just my, it's holding it in place, so this hold, actually holds the carabiner in place. All right, so now we have the balloon actually ready to go. And we might just double check that there's no helium coming out, and you'll be able to feel it. 
so I think we're I think we actually got a tight enough seal for now. God knows we've got enough helium for another round if we lose some. <laughs> um, okay, so now we, this is basically set. What do we need to do now? We need the camera ready. Yeah. Okay, so. Okay, we got it. I have. Do you know which one is this? Is this the IR one? I don't know. Um, yeah. Okay, so. Do you want to put this on first? It's David, right? Or not Wilson? Dan. Dan. I knew it was D. It's All right, so Dan, explain what you've done and how you're setting up the camera. So I put a little rubber band, or double loop rubber band, put a little piece of duct tape ball under it so you can slip it over the button to hold it down for the continuous mode. Wow. Okay, so, so get it going. And so you can hear when it's taking pictures. And you want to check that it's taking focused pictures. Is it taking nice focused pictures? It's really bright. Oh, oh it's oh, right. Right. Careful. Careful, there might be something on the ground. The, the brightness is high. What kind of stuff um, hover? It doesn't look like there's any problem. Is there any reason for that? No, that looks okay. Well, well no, before, like, yeah, when, when, it, when it was actually taking pictures. It looks okay now, but when it's actually taking pictures, it's really bright. Oh, how weird. Yeah. Can you set it onto auto? Um, this is, this is the default for zero. Oh. If you can bring it down. Yeah, I know, it's cool. Or it might be. <laughs> okay, that's a lot that's better. A lot. That's a lot better. Okay. All right. So now it's time to put the rest of the camera ringing on. That's got to be around the back. Yep. Good. The little shutter noise is really like stressful. Yeah. Well, <laughs> yeah. It's also really reassuring. I once did an EPA training at EPA Region Two. Oh. Oh, yeah, it stopped. Oh, sorry, and, guys. Um, <laughs> I forgot, I, it was so hot outside that I forgot to double check it was going. So we did the entire flight, oh. brought the balloon back, and the camera had a big go. I was like, oh, I've learned how to do it. Do it through the camera. It's not ready for It was one of those bake, bake a second cake <laughs> moments. Okay. That sounded good. Okay. Okay, um, insert camera. Well done, Dan. Dan, could you pull that through and hook it on? And you are going to get <laughs> you are going to get many pictures of your hands and your feet. Photo <laughs> <laughs> bomb it. Yeah. Are both well secured? Yeah. Okay. Okie dokie. All right. So now, balloon team, let go for a sec. Let go. Really? Yeah. Okay. Uh. okay. Gently at first, and then we'll see which way the balloon's going. Which way do we think the balloon's going to travel? You know, you've got to see we are right in our assessment. And do you want to just check that that's pointed yeah. nicely down? Ready to cut the line. Ready to cut the line. <laughs> so you can actually, you know, if you're in an empty field, you can really just let it out at this stage. Um, but when you're in a, you know, more populated area, it's good to let it go slowly. But 
you'll see the balloon wants to go straight up as long as there's no wind. And so normally a good flying height is a thousand feet. Um, you know that red reel that I have, that's a thousand foot of line, this is two thousand foot. But we're not going to put it anywhere near that height. I don't know how high we feel safe. Yeah. <laughs> a thousand. <laughs> um, and it really becomes like a speck off in the distance. Oh, really? So there we go, now it's getting sun on it. It's in the sun! Wow. <laughs> the balloon's found so the sun. Beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> so beautiful. <laughs> 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 what's behind you? 